Hey everybody. Hello everybody. Hey everybody. It's Brock. This is Brock. And we got a new episode with another episode of All About. Of All About. All About. What's up everybody? It's Brock and we got a brand new episode of All About today. Today we're learning about the sea cucumber. This video can pretty much be used for any cucumber you get, but the one you are seeing is a tiger tail. Prices on them, you'll spend about 20 bucks on them. Tank size doesn't really matter, but I would not recommend putting like a foot long one in a 20 gallon. You know, be aware of how long he is. Care level, super easy. Temper, they are very peaceful. Reef compatible, yes. Temperature, 72 to 78. Keep your DKH 8 to 12. pH 8.1 to 8.4. And your salinity, 1.023 to 1.025. Diet, they are an omnivore. They pretty much eat diatoms algae, leftovers that you feed your fish, and he's a big time detritus eater. <clears throat> Max size, they can get a foot long. Compatibility, just ask. Uh, I would put one in a tank. I wouldn't really put two. A lot of times whenever you put multiples in a tank, they end up fighting each other. And he, I would choose him to be the only sand sifter in your tank. I wouldn't put other creatures that can go down in the sand like he can because it'll just end up in them fighting for food colors on them there's a bunch of different colors you can get the most common colors are orange or black ones origin they do come from indo-pacific venomous they are venomous when they get stressed or dies uh this is rare a very rare occasion that this will actually happen just make sure you don't let them get sucked up into your filter or power head that is the most common way for these that for these guys to release their venom so cover them up put a filter pad some kind of screen over them just do something that will protect him make sure of course you have a thick sand bed he does like to completely go under there and need plenty of live rock to hide up under or hide next to. I know in the video you can pretty much see how they act in a tank. They like snuggling up right beside a rock and going around to eating stuff. They are normally nocturnal. Like you never see them in the daytime. I just happened. They just came out one day. So I was like, well, I better get this on film. So I did. And that's them doing their job. But that's it for your cucumber. He is a great, great sand sifter to get. You should definitely try him out. And he's not that expensive either. He keeps your sand crystal clear. looks really good. That's it for today. That's the sea cucumber. It is a tiger tail. Hope you all have a good day. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you all later. If you all have any cucumbers, tell me about them. Let me know in the comments on how they're doing in your tank. I'll see you all later. We just hit a 1,000 subscribers. Thank you all so much. I love you all. I can't thank you all enough from that. All started out with me just working in the fish store with an idea to let everyone know how to take care of some fish. And here we are a thousand deep and it feels great. So to celebrate for the whole month of June, every single day, I'm going to put out a new episode of All About, about some kind of fish, some kind of crustacean, maybe different things on how to take care of stuff. But just either way, every single day, you're going to be getting a video from me and it's going to be awesome. Maybe even more videos. So here we go. Stay tuned. Here comes celebrating a thousand subscribers.